Welcome to our newest listing in Waterfall Country Estate, situated in Gate 2. This home offers five bedrooms, all en suite. You've got four garages, double on either side with access into the house. You've got backup power, you've got staff quarters and many living rooms. Please come inside so I can show you around. Okay, so we are now inside and as you'll see, you're greeted by this beautiful entrance hall, double volume ceilings, you can see your chandelier, you can see the bulkheads, frameless glass balustrading, and this area immediately welcomes you to your formal lounge and you've got your gas fireplace so it'll keep you nice and warm in winter and this is kind of a really nice area where you can just sit relax again you can also have a tv so that the the, the area is more functional and if you want to use it as a tv lounge you can but really nice entrance hall with your um, formal lounge then over here you've got a guest toilet situated quite nicely tucked away and you've also got uh, one of your double garages is on this side with access into the house. And this is now one of your guest bedrooms. On the ground floor you've actually got two bedrooms and then upstairs three. And I find it's, it's quite nice because then if you've got older kids or more visitors then they, there are more options on the ground floor. It's not like all the bedrooms are upstairs. So nice big guest bedroom. Your guests might never leave. Lots of built-in cupboards and again you've got a table over here that you can make into a dressing table if you want, you can make it into a study nook. So really nice space to just sit and either get ready or like I said do homework, do some work, whatever the case may be. And it's really nice that you've got a full ensuite bathroom so you've got your bath as well as your shower. So that is your guest quarters or one of them downstairs. So let's go and have a look at the rest of the home. Just while we're here, so that is your other double garage. Again, access into the house, obviously. So that's quite nice. You'll never have to get wet in the rain. Okay, and one of the things that's really nice is you can see that there's stairs going up, not just upstairs, but throughout. So it sort of gives you like different um, layers in the house and it elevates you. So obviously you're then higher and you have better views. So immediately as you come up this passage to your left, you'll see a nice big closed off TV room. You could always make this into a cinema room if you wanted to, but I think it's really nice that this room is closed. So if you wanna sit and watch a movie and you want peace and quiet, you can close the door and just relax. And this obviously, um, you've got a door that takes you to your garden. And then again, we come up a few stairs many lounges many many living rooms in this house and you are greeted by another tv room formal lounge whatever you really want to call the space you can obviously chop and change this could definitely be a tv room because you could have a tv over here so but really nice i mean imagine just sitting here doors open you're cooking in the kitchen you're busy watching a movie like really really nice nice space and it's i love it that it all stacks open and leads to your garden and then again you've got a gas uh, fireplace over here so this will probably heat up the whole of downstairs i think let's go this way we'll save the kitchen for now now this part of the house is basically like your entertainment area again you've got stack doors that open up it opens up to the to the swimming pool as well and this is really nice. You've got a built-in bar. You can sit here, entertain. And obviously, if you don't like drinking, you could always use this as a coffee station or a non-alcoholic bar. That's quite in at the moment. And you've got your built-in braai. You've got a basin. And then again, very big area. They've got another lounge and they've got a dining room area. So really nice space for entertaining. And I would imagine that you'd spend a lot of your time here and again, open up the stack doors, get that indoor outdoor feel. So really, really nice. While we're here, we might as well have a look at the outside. So you've got your swimming pool. Unfortunately, it's closed today. And then you've got your Boma area. What I really like is obviously some of the original rocks that were on the, on the stand, they've kept them in the garden. So I think that's quite a nice feature is you've actually got some like real rocks in the 
in the garden that they didn't take out. So quite nice, beautiful area to sit, have a fire. Okay, so we are back over here and we are gonna have a look at the kitchen. So again, you've got a step going down. So on that side, it does look like it's low, but it's actually normal height. And gas AEG stove, you've got the Smeg microwave and oven, space to keep all your favorite wines. And I like that it is very full. That's all exactly the way a wine rack should look. Nice cupboards, beautiful open plan, modern. And then obviously you've got your separate scullery and pantry. And I mean, look at the attention to detail. I love the bulkhead ceilings. I love the different lights. Really, really nice. Okay, then we've got one more bedroom to have a look at. Like I said, there's two bedrooms downstairs and three upstairs. So let's go and have a look at this bedroom. So this is your second bedroom in the house. So again, nice and spacious. And you've got built-in cupboards. You've got your own ensuite. Again, you've got this uh, bulkhead ceiling feature over here above the bed. So really, really nice space. So two bedrooms downstairs. And I'm really excited to be showing you the rest of the home. Let's go upstairs. Okay, so we are now on the upper level. And as you can see, you are immediately greeted with a really spacious pajama lounge. You've got the bulkhead ceilings, lots of natural light. And I really love that you've got quite a big window over there and you've got stunning views where you can see out. So a nice spacious pajama lounge. And the upstairs floor consists of three bedrooms as well as a study and obviously your pajama lounge. Nice glass balustrading. And we'll start with this bedroom, which is your th uh, third bedroom in the house. We've already seen two downstairs. And look how spacious these bedrooms are. Really, really big. You could easily have a king size bed. You've still got ample space. Doesn't feel crowded. Access to a balcony, built in cupboards. And you've also got your own ensuite with a shower. And again, you've got these high windows, so you get the light, but you've still got a lot of privacy. And obviously, if you open your curtains up, you will uh, to, you also get, bring in a lot of light. So this takes you to the balcony. Beautiful tiles, but the bedrooms are, they've used different tiles in the bedroom. It's those tiles that look like wood, but it's actually tiles. So you won't have issues with if they get too wet and all of that. The laminated flooring is sometimes a little bit difficult. And then I like how the stairs come up to your other two bedrooms. So it sort of like elevates you even more. So let's have a look at your fourth bedroom in the house. Again, nice and spacious. And you've got your ensuite with a shower. I like that you've also got this built in. So if you want to use this as a study table or a dressing table, it's built in. And it's neat, it's uniform, it runs with everything else in the house. So really nice. Bulkhead ceilings above the bed and uh, a little Juliet balcony. So that is your fourth bedroom. Then a little bit further down the passage, you've got this area over here. Again, you could easily put in either linen closets or you could put in desks if you want for the kids. So that's obviously an option. And then let's go and see our favorite part, the main bedroom. Again, lots of light, spacious ensuite bathroom, full ensuite bathroom. Very neat, you've got all the different greys. Everything's working very nicely together. And then you've got an extremely spacious bedroom. Yeah, you can see they've got a king size bed and it's still extremely spacious. You've got space for a lounge. Nice and big, and again, you've got your own balcony. So really nice and private. And then nice big walk-in closet. And again, you've got the built-in dressing table, you've got the island over here, lots of cupboard space. Shouldn't be fights between if the partners if that there's not enough cupboard space. And we won't really show you this because it will 
will catch the cameraman, but you've got a nice big mirror over here. So if you want to get ready in the morning and see that you look okay, this is where you will check. So the only thing we still have left to see upstairs is the study. And it's obviously always good to have a closed study in the house because working from home, or if you just need to do a couple of things, you can sit peacefully and get some work done. And it's quite a big study. And again, you've got the built-in built in desks, built-in cupboards. So you could easily sit, I would say four people here and everyone could have their own little space and you could be productive. So that's the upstairs floor. So thank you so much for watching. I'm sitting on this beautiful navy blue couch. It firstly matches my outfit, but it matches our company color. So I thought this is a great place to sit. The property offers five bedrooms, all en suite, four garages, staff accommodation, multiple living areas. This home is really most families dream. Please give us a call so we can show you around. Thank you.